Hi guys, um, happy Monday. Just wanted to stop in real quick. Show you my hair, about my locks. <laughs> I got this one little boo sticking up. So guys, the humidity still has an effect on your hair, although you have locks. And, all right, here we go. It's nice and rainy and humid out here today. And my hair is swollen up and it's fuzzy. And I don't know what, <laughs> this little baby lock is, is, is straight up in the air. It's getting longer though. And it's just sticking straight up. The baby lock came from broken off edges and bald edges that is that are growing back. Hmm. I also want to show you guys, um, really I want to show you guys how my hair has bunches in it. So whenever you see a lock that's sitting up like this, if you can see it, it's called bunching. So this is the hair is not smooth all the way out. And it caused knots down the shaft of the locks, which I don't mind. I like all my imperfections and perfections about my locks. Let me see if I can find it. Not budding. This is still budding. See how fat it is right here on the end? That's budding. It means it's still not mature. You can see my tips are still straight. They're not sealed up yet like this was not even sealed up. You can still see like a little naughty ball at the tip right here. Yeah, it's still not sealed up. Let's see if I can find another bunch, bunching lock. There goes one. Can you get rid of bunching the bunches? The Yeah, they say you can. You can just this this comes from the hair curling up and it's trying to um spring up and not straighten itself out. I was told that this usually happens when you start your hair off, your locks off long. And so, here goes a bunchy. So some people will crochet it in, or some people just spray some water on them and just try to elongate the lock so it won't have those knots and hiccups and stuff in it, but I'm not doing that because I don't care. So yeah, that's what, you know what bunching means when you take a bunch, when you take a, a whole lot of something and you just make, put it all together, it's just a bunch. So that's what the hair is doing here. I don't really think it's doing it in the back too much though. It's so humid out here. Let me see if I can find a back lock that's bunching. My back is not bunching as much because it's a kinkier texture, but my crown is looser. Oh, here goes a little bunching nut. Oh, is this my crown? Oh, that's my crown. <laughs> my Oh my God, my locks getting so long, guys. The crown is back there with the back of my hair. I thought that was the back, but no, that's the crown up here. Here goes somewhat of a sealed lock. And here goes a not sealed lock. You see on the tip, it's got a little straggly ends, whereas the back, the kinkier part, is probably almost all the way locked, or maybe locked. It's still some kind of soft on the tip. So yeah, bunching is when the hair is so I guess it's not straight and smooth, and it just tends to go like this, and it bunches in, in knots. But I don't mind. Doesn't bother me. I saw the bunches in my locks a long time ago, and I didn't even think about trying to straighten them out. I guess because I didn't care. Um, they say I'm considered a semi-free form person, whereas I wear my locks more free. I'm not so into super tightly coiled locks. I'm not into super, yeah, super neatness, and I don't do a lot. I don't style my hair. I don't. Uh, try to make sure every hair is in place. I uh, don't trip off the parts too much. I just let it be. And then I'll retwist it. So this year, guys, I only retwist it twice this year in 2024. And when I did retwist, I had to uh, smooth my hair. I had to go down the shaft of my locks and kind of like uh, mold them back to cylindrical or cylinder, whatever they call it. 
more locks because some of them had gotten flat. And I got a flat lock in here still. I saw it the other day. I said, oh, this lock's still flat. So if you don't like flat locks, you might want to do more, you know, keep up with the maintenance a little bit more. Whereas I don't. But I had pulled my hair down the back while it was dry and it's touching right at the top of my bra strap. I can't believe it. So it's getting pretty long, pretty fast. So guys, I just wanted to stop in and talk about some bunching. Now I retwisted my hair, I think a month ago. It's growing already. My little new growth is, my parts are cloudy with hair already. But that's what hair does. Hair grows every day. If you don't do nothing to your hair, your hair will grow. If you don't shampoo it, because people think you got to shampoo your hair uh, regularly so your hair can grow. Uh, no, your hair grows if you don't do nothing to it. Uh, if you wear braids, braids make hair grow. Uh, no, your hair grows if you don't have any braids. So, I don't do anything to my hair and it grows. I did oil it one day last week. I need to add some, um, really I don't need to add no moisturizer because it's humid out here. So the humidity is moisturizing my hair naturally. There go that, there go that boy. He waiting on the squirrel. You better watch him, boy. Anyway, he watching. He looking for the, he looking for, where he go? Is that, he's still on the camera, there he is. He looking for the squirrel in the tree. Take care of business. Boy. You better watch that you better watch that little ugly squirrel face. Mm-hmm. Yeah guys, I'm having a good morning. I'm having a good morning. Uh, I'm 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 ready to go take a nap. And re re not rewind. Unwind my mind for a minute. And <sighs> Get up and do a little something. I don't know what that little something would be. Uh oh, he, he mean he mean business. He gotta chase every car, every truck, every van. <laughs> In the mail truck, you know, he does not like the mail truck. No dog likes the mail trucks. I don't know what it is about the mail truck. I don't know what it is about this baby lock. Ah. <laughs> so guys, when I retwisted it, I had this lock in with this lock. And he, she said, no, I'm still a baby girl. I don't want to be with nobody. I want to be by myself. So she came on out, and this is how she looked. And you know what? I'm just going to let her be. I should just let her be for the rest of the day. Go on, baby girl. That's her name, little baby girl. <laughs> but, all right, guys. Um, so, I hope you are enjoying your Monday. Let me know if you have locks and you have bunching going on with your locks. Um, if you don't, let me know how you feel. If you would have had some bunches in your locks, do you know anybody with a bunch of bunches in their locks like me? Because I got them. They're mainly in my crown. I don't know what this guy doing right here. His, this is a really, a, really a strange one. Every lock is unique. This is really strange. <laughs> Does it bother you if you do have bunches? Do you prefer not to have them or do you care like I do? I don't. All right. So I'm going to see you guys soon. Bye-bye, Nico. Boy. Nico, boy. You want to say bye? He, uh, no, he's on, he's on squirrel alert. Nico's on squirrel alert. He, he has to take care of business. He's on, he's on full-fledged squirrel alert. Look at that stance. He is in full concentration mode <laughs> all right guys i'll see you soon bye